everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I have my friend San San. Hello everyone. Today we're doing a get ready with, with us, us because we're going to a Christmas, Christmas party, party tonight. Party tonight. So we have all our makeup laid out right here, our mirrors mm -hmm. here. So if we're looking down here, we're looking at our mirrors. So let's get right into it. Yeah, yeah. let's get started. So what are you gonna do first? I'm going to do the foundation first. Okay. Yeah. So I'm using the Lancome mm -hmm. Ultra Wear. I talked about this in my last video. If you guys haven't watched it, I'll try to leave, leave a link somewhere over here it's for you guys to find it. We have already applied our skincare mm -hmm. and sunscreen yes. and primer. I'm also yep. going to start with the foundation. I'm going to use this Dior Skin Forever. Ooh. I think it's supposed to last like a long lasting makeup and i used it a lot during the summer times mm -hmm. and today it's kind of hot so i just picked this one out actually i forgot i'm, I'm gonna apply the primer because i forgot to apply primer i'm using <laughs> i'm using the hourglass vel mineral primer yeah i heard about this one i think it's supposed to hide your pores right yeah it's really good so i'm looking at my uh, mirror down here i just apply a little bit first Actually, a little bit goes a long way for this. Yeah, what I usually do is just to dab a, a thin layer mm -hmm. of foundation first and then I'll use like either beauty blender or brush to even it out. What do you like use better? Like, do you like beauty blender or do you like the brush? I like brush because it's, it's very fast. Yeah, I like, I find that brush is really fast mm -hmm. but I think sponge also has its good um yeah like if you yeah. want something like a dewy finish mm -hmm. I think sponge helps that yeah and yeah I'm gonna use this artiste brush and this is my all-time favorite oh my yeah <laughs> that's huge Look yeah this it. is Show a huge uh, I think this one is a size 6 it's not the oh. biggest one I have a size 10 and I use it for like a finish powder brush yeah, so this one is really good and you can apply it very fast and it just it just goes very well with all my um, foundation. I remember the one you gave me, I still mm -hmm. use it. But it's really dirty right now, so I'm not I'm uh, trying to clean it. How often usually, do I yeah, wash how it? often do you usually wash your brush? Uh, there isn't a set time because I don't do makeup every day. I do like maybe once a week on the mm -hmm. weekend if I have things to do. And as long as it just go smooth I'll just keep using it but sometimes when you use it for several times and you see like the the foundation kind of absorbed in there like the finish won't be perfect so I'll just wash yeah, it that's at true. that time because you have like the leftover yeah, foundations yeah, on exactly. top okay. so I'm just dabbing it onto my face I just like to put one layer of this because it's very it's more on the heavier side, mm -hmm. so I don't like to put two. Since my skin, my skin is more on the dry, drier side, and sometimes it can look really cakey whenever I put on too much foundation. Mm -hmm. So I try to put, uh, if it's like a thicker formula, I try to put on only one layer of it. Oh, it has sunscreen. It yeah, has it has sun. sunscreen. When I first start uh, doing makeup, mm -hmm. I didn't know much about makeup, and I was like putting foundation on my face and I totally forgot about my neck and then you can see like, oh, the, like two, the different <laughs> two different shades on mm -hmm. um of the foundation. So yeah just dab dab dab. Yep. Oh by the way I'm using this concealer from Clay de Paul. Um never heard of that brand. Uh it's like in some of the department store. It's mm -hmm. a Japanese brand. Oh yeah. So near my nose area i just like to use my finger to dab it i'm already done with my foundation yeah. <laughs> i'm going to you go ahead going. apply this um um compressed powder from nars the translucent Ooh. compressed powder i have used this for i don't know like f used up five or four package packs already wow yeah <laughs> oh, wow. and Oh you my gosh! See this one, I have already hit pan. There's like none left. Yeah. This is my all-time mm -hmm. favorite as well. Wow. Because I've must tried be all really different uh, other brands, but because uh, I'm kind of oily skin and like mm -hmm. in, in Houston it's hot and it's humid, so I don't want 
I don't want the makeup just come off. It gets really, really humid here in Houston, so when we do makeup here, you know, you gotta put on extra yep. to make sure Secure. that it stays on. Okay, I'm done with my foundation. The next thing that I'm gonna go into is my eye. Uh, for my eyes. Oh, do you do eyes first? Yeah, I like to do my eyes mm. first. So when you go take a shower, do you wash your hair first or wash your body first? Uh, like if I have to wash my hair, I wash my hair first. Okay. If I don't wash my hair, then mm -hmm. I wash my body first. Mm -hmm. What about you? Hair first. Here I'm using the Naked 2 Urban Decay Basics palette. And actually this one, I only use the first two colors, mm -hmm. the base of my eyelids, because the rest of the colors, they're more like cool tone. I'm, for me, I don't look good in cool tone colors because like it looks like I just got punched in the face. Yeah, I like I, think, I like warmer colors. I think that makes sense. Yeah, I feel like warm tone colors are better for Asians. Mm -hmm, yeah, because our, our skin, skin tone yeah, is it's like already yellowy color, and then uh, adding more cool tones is just gonna make us look like pandas. <laughs> Go to do my eyebrow using this from Benefit. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm using my favorite eyeshadow palette, Becca. I introduced it in my last video. Like I said, if you haven't seen it, go and check it out. And I'm gonna go in with this color first. So just a little bit. It's like the first high-end eyeshadow I bought. I think before when I bought like uh, mm -hmm. eyeshadow, it was like Maybelline quads. You know those? Like four different kinds. Oh, okay. Yeah. But like this one is like more like on the high end yeah. side. When do you start to um, do makeup? Uh, when I graduated from high school. Oh, okay. Like going into college, cause before like college, I don't really care about makeup at all. Mm -hmm. Like I never got into makeup. I like never do my brows. I started getting into makeup in college, and then the more I do it, I enjoy it a lot. So I just keep doing it. Now I'm gonna grab this angle, angled brush. It's kind of slanted, and go in with this, this color, on the outer corner of my eyes. What are you doing? I'm still doing my eyebrow. I think eyebrow, to me, eyebrow and lipstick is the main thing of makeup. Mm -hmm. Like, if I don't apply any, like if I can only choose three things, that would mm -hmm. be foundation, eyebrow, and That's lipstick. That's true. I didn't care at all about eyebrows. Yeah. I was just like, I don't care. But then it was like my mom that was the one that told me to do my brows. Yeah. It's like, it frames your face, right? Mm -hmm, exactly. Yeah. So I like to pack. Quite a lot. Since we're going to a party tonight, I like to make sure that it's visible, you know. <laughs> I'm going to use this um, eyeshadow palette from NARS. It's called so cute. Saint Paul de France. Yeah, it's a it's a small town in South Prova uh, South France. Oh, it's like this one. Okay. Oh, it's so tiny and mm -hmm. cute. It has only two shades. I'm just blending it out with my blending brush. I like to get this little pointy brush and apply this color on the lower lash line. Just a little bit, not too much. I can tell you already used up a lot from this palette. <laughs> I do like this palette because it's not like this palette is not like super yeah it's like pigmented mm -hmm. yeah it feels like it's a daily if it's for the daily makeup and it's like good for beginners because it doesn't just like mm -hmm. whoa like yeah color in your face this weird face that i always make whenever i do this <laughs> <laughs> it's like what color are you using mm, and it's kind of a peach peachy color mm -hmm. Ooh. then since it's going to be a Christmas party I'd like to add a little bit of shimmer onto my eyelids this is the super shock cheek from Colourpop in Wisp talked about this again in my last video this is 
really pretty and very creamy. You want to try some? This uh, is really nice. A highlighter? Yeah, highlighter, but I sometimes use it as a... a Are your eyelids? Mm -hmm. Wow! Just give it a little shine. Mm -hmm. It looks very natural. Mm -hmm. What's like one of the things that you find the hardest to apply for makeup? I think eyeshadows because mm -hmm. I'm not really good at it. Mm -hmm. And I don't need do it very often. For me, it's eyebrows. I hate doing my oh, eyebrows. Really? Yeah. Let me see your brows. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wait, did you do your brows already? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Nice. Yeah. What does your brow, um, like, like before you do your brows, does it have a shape already? Um, it, it has a little bit and I just try to draw it myself. Mm -hmm. I'm just very familiar with yeah. how I draw it. That's good because my brow don't have a specific shape and I'm just kind of like... Du -du 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 -du. Next, after eyeshadow is eyeliner. Maybelline Unstoppable mm -hmm. Eyeliner Unstoppable. in Espresso. The waterline. I'm curling my uh, eyelashes now and this thing is from Suku. I like it a lot. It's really mm. helped to bring out each single lash. What's that brand called? Suku. It's Suku. also Japan. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, oh, oh. Excuse uh, Sansan, she accidentally popped out her contacts. <laughs> <laughs> so she'll be right back. You're back. Come no. in, a, come in a little bit. Come in a little bit. It's okay. <laughs> Cause I, I'm just trying to get the very end of the lash. I've never heard of that <gasps> before. Like doing curling uh, lashes and then pop out the contacts. Whoa, that's a typical me. <laughs> Usually, how long um, does it take for you to do your makeup? Like a full, a full okay, look. Thing. Yeah. Fifteen minutes. Fifteen. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Well, my everyday makeup is just ten, less than 10 minutes if I no, do. I mean like um, special occasion makeup. A special occasion. Yeah. Like full on look. Then that would be 30 minutes, I think. Yeah, same here. Mm -hmm. I like to do next is bronzer and blush. So the last thing that I usually do is my brows. So I'm not getting to my brows yet. But I'm doing... So I have two options for... Uh, blush, either the Benefit Rocketeur or the NARS Dual. So I'm gonna go for the NARS, this one. Just tap, 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 and then tap, tap. I'm going to put mascara. Yay! What is that? Which one is that? Uh, this is Clay de Paul as well. This oh. is also my favorite. Nice. Is it smudge proof? My eyes are pretty easy to smudge because mm -hmm. I'm oil skin. So after this, I'm gonna use a use this from Clarence. It's uh -huh. it's more like a raincoat thing. Like you put the final layer on top of that. Go into bronzer. Oh, did you do blush first and bronzer? Yeah, I actually messed up the order. I usually do bronzer first, mm -hmm. and then I go into blush, but I think I got too excited on the blush. <laughs> <laughs> so I just... I like this. Did you already get heat pan of that? Wow. Uh -huh. Wow. I really, really like this But bronzer. I have a mini doll of this one. Mm -hmm. It just looks really natural on the... Mm -hmm. The okay. Laguna. Yeah. I always like your um, eyelashes. Oh. Every time I see you do it, <laughs> yeah. every time I see her like outside of um, our houses and stuff, I'm like, just keep staring at her eyes. I'm just, like, <laughs> just love the eye makeup and the eyelashes. It's really pretty. And, and sometimes, just sometimes, I like to contour my nose a little bit oh wow. oh yeah, yeah that's the thing i'm yeah. very bad at yeah i'm bad at that <laughs> too but i borrow your bronzer i think yeah. i forgot it did i forget it just a tiny bit yeah, you know i think i i think i forget it yeah okay, you can, can borrow it. a little bit there. go ahead okay yeah 
just like that just, mm -hmm. just just a little bit you know highlight so I got two here the Becca and the ColourPop I'm gonna go for the ColourPop because I use this also on my eyelids so I just do a little bit on the bridge of my nose thank you yeah Feel okay. free to use anything you like. I'm going to apply my blushes as well. This one's from Clinic. Mm, Clinic. Clinic. Nice. It's called Nude Pop. Oh, New Pop. I heard mm -hmm. that that's pretty good. Because I heard that that one, mm -hmm. that specific line is really good. Like that? Okay. And... It doesn't really show here in the camera, right? Yeah. Like You can't really see. Mm -hmm. Next... Finally, I'm going into my brows. Oh my goodness, my yeah. brows. Ay, ay, ay. I'm just putting a little bit more. Oh my gosh, I'm almost done with this. Look at the oh wow, That's yeah, congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> no, not congratulations. No, I got to buy another one. No, but I like this feeling like I used I know, that's everything. true. Highlighter. This one is from Dior as well. Ooh, nice. This one called Dior. All Skin Nude Air Luminizer. Nice. Number one. Thank you. Sounds gorgeous. And I'm going to use this blush. Uh, this brush is from Wayne Gross. Wayne Goss. You know this guy? I've he heard has a it. YouTube channel as well. What's his name? Wayne Goss. I might have to look it up. I just put a very, very, very light layer of this because this color is a lot darker and then I will fill it in with another brow pencil mm. okay okay going to use this lipstick primer it's from MAC it's called prep and prime mm -hmm. it really helps to hold your uh, lipstick so like after you have this and then you drink something you won't it won't show on the glass and you will still have it even after you drink or eat wow so it's really good before you go to a party really i'm hard. going to use this one from pat mcgrath oh pat mcgrath mm -hmm. what's the shade it's oh like stretch a little bit <laughs> i've been told that brows are not twins they're sisters so they're supposed to look different. Mm -hmm. Exactly. My uh, family, like my families, like to laugh at me <laughs> whenever they see my brows. They're like, uh, one is up, one is down, one is too darker, one is lighter than the other one. I'm like, Ugh, I I tried my best. I can't. Have you ever heard of uh, microblading? Microblading? Mm hmm What is that? It's like a eyebrow tattoo. Not, oh, not like. Not permanently, I yeah, think. Yeah, yeah, I think I know it. Yeah. Like, uh, my mom actually did it. Mm -hmm. I just don't know it's English now. But you still have to go in a couple months to fill it in. But I thought about doing that, mm -hmm. but I heard it's really, really expensive. <laughs> so I was like, mm, okay, I'll just go through the pain of I drawing. I think my mom has been like, like, 600, I guess. <gasps> 600? But it will last for two three years oh mm -hmm. okay wait 600 for both brows or just one brow no both oh my gosh two years i guess that's kind of that's pretty worth it okay this is the best i can do for my brows i'm just gonna leave it at that and i'm pretty much done now i just gotta do my lashes is it too much no it's beautiful thank you it's really pretty Oh wow! This is good. Mm -hmm. It, it makes... really helps to bring out, and it does. It's not, wow! Oh it's my not gosh! Mm -hmm. This is nice. Last but not least, I'm doing my lips, and Sunshine got my purse for me. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, oops, sorry. Because I leave my lipsticks in my purse. I don't really take them out. So I do these two combos. I like to do the color pop. Ooh, wow. This one first. Is this like a nude color? No, this is like a uh, it's, it's like kind a, of like mocha, like a 
winter color. Yeah, winter、mm-hmm. color. Yeah, whenever fall time comes or winter time comes, I pull these darker colors out.、Mm-hmm. So I just put it on the inside. Root beer. Root beer. Yeah, I like root beer. Mac Velvet Teddy. Mmm. Yes, this one's my favorite. It's almost out too. Oh wow! I know wow. this is my second one. Wow! I can <laughs> never imagine I would use up a、uh, lipstick. Yeah, I love lipstick. Like even when I'm not wearing makeup, when I'm just going outside,、yeah. I still wear it. Okay. 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 That is pretty much wow. everything. Wow.、Yeah. Let me see your makeup. Wow.、Uh, we have very different style. Yours、yeah. is more natural. I told、mm-hmm. you I'm gonna do a mat- natural one, but、mm-hmm. I still once I add this lipstick on. <laughs> you have a little、mm-hmm. lipstick on your teeth. Okay. Thank you. Mhm. It's pretty. I keep looking at your <laughs> eyes. It's so pretty. Okay,、yeah. I'm like being a creeper, but it's so pretty. Mhm. If you can see our makeup. Shall we get closer? Yeah, let's get closer. Yeah. Ugh. Get closer. And just here.、Yeah. You can see. Guys, that's everything. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. And please give this video a thumbs up if you like to see more of my、yeah. friends come on videos with me. Don't forget to hit that notification bell below so you、mm-hmm. know when my next video comes on. See you guys next time. See you、Bye. next time. Bye.